Good evening, everyone. Another full case break of 2018-19 Panini Contenders Basketball. 12 box, pick your team number two from jazbeescasebreaks.com. We've got more in the store. We've got plenty of this stuff, ladies and gentlemen. There's random team versions available as well. So if you're like, Joe, I don't, I don't, got, I don't got Mavs money, you know, but you may stumble into the Mavs in a random team break. So check that out, jazbeescasebreaks.com. We've got full case break. Pick your teams available as well. Pick your team two on a Thursday. Thanks, everyone here. Lou, Last Spot Mojo Rockets. Thanks, everybody, for rallying around this break. Appreciate it. Some strong stuff in this basketball, ladies and gentlemen. So let's keep pushing on it. Now, John Ogre, we're just talking off camera. He was saying he saw a, a promo on jazbeescasebreaks.com. <laughs> that was on the site for a second and then disappeared. And John Oakley said he, he was excited and intrigued by this. I'm not intrigued by how I'm sliding these boxes out of here. Good Lord, look at all, what a mess. All right, so there's four boxes here. Come on, Joe. This is not going to be a personal best on time for this. All right. 12 boxes, two autographs per box. There we go. And we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. All right. Good luck, ladies and gentlemen. Obviously, we want to find the hot rookies here. If you look at our Twitter, at Jaspies Breaks, You'll see a nice hit, that kid right there. Two autographs per box on average. And um, and a strong seller on the secondary market, ladies and gentlemen, if you're into that sort of thing. All right, good luck, everybody. Joe P is in the house. Joe, have you pulled the Chrome rookie ticket autos? Yes. We had a Colin Sexton last night. I actually have a picture of that to post on our social as well, on our social media at some point. They're pretty cool looking. Are they somewhat rare? That I don't know. I know as an insert, they're pretty common. We generally see one or two a box. But I don't know how rare they are. I mean, they're inserts, so it is shorter printed than, than obviously the base stuff. But beyond that, I'm not sure. Anyone else know? The checklist is out. Might be more information there. No, can't find anything on cardboard connection. I don't know. We'll we'll look at we'll look at the fine print a little bit later. But that's usually where they where they get that information. So uh, we'll try to do some research after this. All right. Good luck, everybody. First autograph out of the gate is Omari Spellman, up and coming autograph. One ninety nine out of one ninety nine. All right, nice start for the Atlanta Hawks. Dave Barros on the board. So these inserts, of course, will ship. Veteran base will not ship per usual. Vet commons. Obviously, serial numbered stuff like this. DeMarcus Cousins out of 135 will ship. We'll sleeve and top load those. Our shipping team will take care of that before they go. This is what uh, Joe P. I think was talking about. So these are, it's like Contenders Optic, right? But it's Contenders in that chrome format. This is this particular one's a season ticket that will ship. Some of those are autographed. But I guess Joe P is curious, hey, how rare are those? Not sure. If anybody knows, feel free to let us know in the chat. Share that knowledge together. So they could be season tickets or rookie tickets or whatever. A bunch of different tickets. And your second autograph, wow, 
There it is. Rookie ticket. Josh Okogie. Gold. This is exactly what Joe P was talking about. And the gold, there's number right there. Eight out of ten. Nice low number. And that will go to the Timberwolves. Jerry Bennington with the T-Wolves. I was wondering last night if there were parallels of those, and question answered. There are. Playoff ticket to 199, Dennis Smith Jr. Nice one for the Mavs. All right, box one in the books. Nice start. Next box. All right, good luck, ladies and gentlemen. On the NBA scoreboard today, um, I made some uh, financial investments in the success of the Milwaukee Bucks, the Houston Rockets, the Los Angeles Lakers, and the Portland Trailblazers. Bucks beat the Knicks by 16. I was a little off on there. I had the Knicks plus my, uh, plus 14 and a half. Bucks won by 16, 112 to 96. Knicks were keeping it close, but Bucks pulled away in the fourth quarter pretty easily. Um, James Harden, who was questionable, there he is right there too, was questionable for tonight's game, ended up scoring 45 points in a big win over the Celtics. They were hosting Boston. Rockets beat the Celtics 127-113. I was on the side of the Rockets. Money line. And we got three more games in progress right now. The closest one to... Finishing is the Lakers Kings game. Lakers are up by a point in the third quarter. I had the Lakers. Was on the on the position of the Lakers. Hopefully they'll win. Did not have any financial interest or investments in the Sixers or the Jazz. But Sixers are leading the Jazz 48 to 46. 430 in the second quarter. And there's Eli Okobu. On-card rookie ticket autograph, Dave Barros with the Phoenix Suns. So anyhow, 48-46, to 46, Sixers with a slim lead in the second quarter. And the Trailblazers are leading the Warriors by a point, 44-43, with a couple minutes left in the second quarter. Playoff ticket, Chris Dunn out of 199. He's been playing pretty well. So the, that was from the first box. This is auto one of two, second box. Also, I, I like the, I don't like the Celtics. I'm a Lakers guy, but I like the big logos that are on in the background right there. I think that looks pretty sharp. This is a good looking set. I, that, I wonder if the football is going to look like this too. That's a nice, it's a nice look. Oh, nice, Jeremy. Jeremy, who won a uh, a box of five star from the Saint Nick promo. All right, I'll t I'll take a look after this break. Nice, Dante Divincenzo, three out of twenty five, cracked ice rookie ticket autograph for the Milwaukee Bucks. Dave Barros with that one. Nice one, Dave. Nice. So that's autograph two. Now let's see if there's. Any parallels here that we like? Nice cracked ice. Kevin Garnett. Celtics edition. That'll go to Mark Matson with the C's. Little oppo Joe Mojo. We got Clay Thompson to 135. Warriors. Warriors come out to play. Warriors, kind of a weird, weird stretch for the Warriors. 
I think Clay Thompson hasn't been, really been shooting well. Draymond has been shooting awful. Awfully. Awful. He's been playing awful. Lee. Um, and they're, they're, they're down five points at home to the Portland Trailblazers. I have the Trailblazers plus nine. So I'm feeling pretty good so far. But Warriors traditionally come out firing in the third quarter. And I don't think they want to lose two games in a row. I don't even know when the last time that's happened. Lakers beat them the other night. I got lucky there. I had them Lakers plus 340. Um, so we'll keep an eye on the scores here as... As we go along in this break, this is Pick Your Team 2, Contenders Basketball, brand new release just dropped yesterday. If you want to do some more, go to jazbeescasebreaks.com. A lot of great stuff there. A lot of basketball and many other stuff. So check it out, jazbeescasebreaks.com. Buy a spot or two and see what happens. All right, there's Lonzo Ball. I think he's been been kind of watching the Lakers game out of the corner of my eye. I feel like he's been doing okay. And sophomore contenders, 9 out of 199, Frank Tilakina for the Knicks. And that'll go to TC with the New York Knicks. Someone was saying yesterday, was it Kevin? I forgot who it was. Someone was, we were talking about where Kevin Durant is going to go. I think Kaham maybe. Someone was talking about this. I was thinking that Kevin Durant will go to the Knicks. Could be interesting. Could be a pretty good spot for him. There's Ben Simmons to 135. Nice one for the Sixers. And, wow, we pulled a cracked ice Luka Doncic last night, and here's an up-and-coming autograph of Luka Doncic. 54 out of 199. Two for two. Josh Reich with the Mavs. Nice. Playoff ticket, Aaron Gordon to 199 for the Orlando Magic. Nice. We'll actually we'll even set this aside for picture time for social social media. We're not, even, we're not even close to being halfway through this break. Nice start, everybody. At the half, Trailblazers up 52-46 on the Warriors. Warriors only managing 18 points in the second quarter. They're scoring 28 in the first. Trailblazers have been pretty consistent. 27 in the first, 25 in the second quarter. We'll see what the Warriors do. Warriors usually come out firing in the third quarter, so that might be the decider in the game. But then again, I think someone mentioned to me that that the Trailblazers at Damian Lillard, you know, scores buckets loads of points in the fourth quarter. So we'll see how that works out by the end. Sixers Jazz almost reaching. They're about two minutes away, minute 56 away from halftime. They're tied 50 to 50 right now. All right, next one. Good luck, everybody. And that's our autograph right there already. And it's going to be... Oh, nice. 
Wow, a one of one, three color patch auto, Mo Wagner. Nice. He's got to work on that auto a little bit, Mo. If you're going to be a Laker legend. But Mark Matson with that one of one. This was the Lakers' first round pick, Michigan, Michigan guy, I believe. Yeah, there it is. Nice. Is he playing tonight? I know Zubach, Vitsa Zubach has been getting some starts here. But no, he's on he hasn't entered the game yet, but definitely a work in progress. Could be an interesting big man in the next over the next couple of years. Mark Madsen, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo! Getting that Laker Joe Mojo. There's Mike Conley to 199. And... Nice one for the Clippers. Up and coming autograph. 84 out of 199. Shea Gilgius Alexander. SGA going to TC and the Clippers. Nice one, Tim. There you go. He's been playing some good ball, too. Nice two autographs. LA autos right here. Front row seat, LeBron. Set those aside as well. Finals ticket to 99, D'Angelo Russell, D'Lo for the Nets. Former Laker. And the next box. This stuff appears to be loaded, ladies and gentlemen. First case was great. This case has been solid. One of one, some nice rookies, Luka Doncic already, and still plenty of boxes to go. Good luck, everybody. Good luck, everybody. Next box, next two autographs. Maybe next numbered card, low numbered card, perhaps. And we've got nice Michael Porter Jr. Nice rookie ticket autograph for the Denver Nuggets. Nuggets are on the board. That goes to DMAC, Darren McKenzie. And Kevin Durant, cracked ice, 15 out of 25. Nice season ticket. That goes to Jay Matsumoto and the Warriors. Nice. Nice one, Jay. Warriors come out to play. And there it is, legendary contenders for the Pacers. 116 out of 199. Steph Jackson. That'll go to the Pacers. Jeremy Merle on the board with that legendary contender. Those are your two autos. 
Let's see if there's any parallels here. There's Jaron Jackson Jr. Nice Reggie Jackson conference finals ticket at a 135 for the Pistons. Steph Curry in that chrome format. Nice, another solid box in the books. Next one, ladies and gentlemen, good luck. Those Sixers in Utah, they get to the half, leading 57-52. Lakers lead by 10 right now, 88-78. Kings calling a full timeout. Next two autographs. Good luck, everybody. And it's going to be a one-of-one one Chandler Hutchinson. Wow. EA with the Bulls and a train whistle, Eric. Nice. All aboard. Whoop, whoop. Another one of one. We've got more of this in the store, folks. Jaspiescasebreaks.com. I like these die cuts, too. We'll set that Kyrie aside. Playoff ticket, Dion Waiters to 199 And your second auto is Anthony Simons, Portland Trailblazers. That'll be for AD, Alex Donnelly. Nice. Another nice box. Finals ticket, Lou Williams to 99, 25 out of 99. Clip show. All right, folks. We've got six boxes left. We are halfway through this full case break. Good luck, boys and girls. EA, just a little behind, says, nice. There you go, man. Quick look at the conference standings in the NBA, ladies and gentlemen. Gives us a, this basketball gives us a good excuse to kind of get an idea of what's going on in, in the hoops world. Raptors leading the East. With a 26 and 10 record, Bucks are a game behind them with a 24 and 10 record. Then the Pacers 23 and 12, Sixers 22 and 13, Celtics 20, 14 record. Pistons are in the sixth seed right now at a 500 record, 16 and 16. Hornets at 16 and 17, and the Miami Heat at 16 and 17 occupy the 7-8 spot. Ma Nets, Magic. Wizards, Hawks, Bulls, Knicks, Cavs. That's how the bottom half of the Eastern Conference kind of rounds out.
We'll go through the West after this. No under 500 teams are in the top eight in the West. East could be interesting. No, no more LeBron for the Cavs. So Toronto Raptors could could see themselves in a finals maybe. Milwaukee Bucks. I feel like Giannis is just getting, as scary as it sounds, is getting better each year. I'm pretty sure he didn't start playing basketball until much later in life, Giannis Antetokounmpo. And I'm pretty sure he's still learning the game. There's more Mo Wagner. 169 out of 199. Up and coming autograph for Mark Matheson and my Lakers. Nice LeBron superstars die cut. I'm sure LeBron, this is among the first couple sets with him, a Lakers jersey right here. So I'm sure there's some, some value there. But yeah, Milwaukee Bucks could be in the mix. There's Tony Parker to 199. Pacers, Pacers look good. They're the third seed currently, 23 and 12. They've quietly been playing some good basketball. Celtics, I know really haven't hit their stride yet. Pistons could be interesting. New coach there, Raptors coach. Hornets. Kemba Walker's been playing well. And there's Michael Bridges' rookie ticket autograph for the Suns. That's Dave Barrows with that one. Dave, I feel like we're getting warmer and warmer. Towards uh, DeAndre Ayton. We got DeAndre Jordan to 135. To round out the East, I don't know, looks like Cavs will get another high round, high first round pick. They're 8 and 27. I think they're the worst team in basketball, right? Yeah, they're, they're about a game worse than the uh, Phoenix Suns. Phoenix Suns might end up with another high pick as well. Cavs might need a little work, but Phoenix Suns could be could be interesting. I mean, they look bad now, but if you watch them, they're actually playing some decent basketball. I think defense has kind of cost them a hand a few games or so. Um, but I think, like, can you imagine? You got DeAndre Aiden. You got a big man. You got you got just a lights out scorer in Devin Booker. Got a couple other good pieces around them too. You know, if they end up with another, like, top five pick or something like that, add that to the team, maybe a couple free agents. It could be a scary team in a few years. Remember, sports works in, sports works in uh, cycles, right? So, I mean, you can see... You can see the, the Golden State Warriors, not, not perfect this year. They, they seem very mortal this year. You know, they can't keep that team together. Costs a lot of money. Players are getting older. Players have different ambitions. Wow, nice. Another Laker, AC Green. 63 out of 199. She looks like AC Green. Don't call me anymore. That goes to Mark Matheson. Rick Barker saying if the Suns' owners could get out of their own way, they'd be pretty good. There's Carmelo to 135. Al Horford.
And it's Colin Sexton. Nice up-and-coming autograph. 129 out of 199 for the Cavs. Dave Barros with the Cavs. Nice Colin Sexton. Colin Sexton does well this season. Cavs with another high first round pick. You know, maybe some Jordan Clarkson, Larry Nance Jr. to kind of round things out. A couple free agents here and there. They might they might be in the mix. Out of 199 later on down the road. That was a nice Ola Depot for the Pacers, by the way, to 199. And there you go. Those are your two autographs right there. Very nice. Four boxes to go. In the West, the Warriors are on top of the way. They look mortal. You know, they don't look as invincible as they have. When you play that many games over the last however many years, I guess it'll and they've got some good depth, but it'll 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 start catching up to you. Draymond not having a good season. Especially recently. Clay Thompson. You know, struggling a little bit. Steph Curry battling some injuries back in the action. Kevin Durant's still strong, but they're definitely beatable. Denver Nuggets right behind the Warriors, you guys. 21-11 and 11 for the Nuggets. They're playing some good basketball. OKC right up there, 21-12. and 12. They're the third seed right now. So it looks like that Russell Westbrook, Paul George, Stephen Adams combo... There you go. Looks like that's pretty strong. My Lakers are right there, 20 and 14. Tied with the Clippers, who are also 20 and 14. In fact, they face each other tomorrow, in the next couple days, I think, sometime this week. Lakers and Clippers will be battling each other, and they both have the same record right in the middle of a uh, fourth, fifth seed, right around there. So, right in the middle of that playoff pack. Rockets, 19 and 15. That's a slow start for the Rockets this season. Chris Paul injured, but they're starting to heat up. Starting to heat up. They're they're 19 and 15, along with the Trailblazers 19 and 15. Spurs are 19 and 16. That rounds out the top eight. Sacramento Kings, who my Lakers are playing right now, uh, Lakers are winning 97 86 with 10 minutes left in the fourth quarter. And there's Jacob Evans for the Warriors. Speaking of the Warriors, up and coming autograph 66 out of 199, going to Jay. And the Warriors. The Kings have been playing some good basketball, too. They're 18 and 16. Memphis Grizzlies, hot start, 18 and 16, just on the outside of a playoff spot looking in. What's going on with the Jazz? 17 and 18. So much promise last year, but I've heard some rumblings that maybe the Jazz kind of took, the, took their foot off the gas, thinking they can kind of coast into the playoffs again, but the West is tough. Mavericks are right there, 16 and 17. Timberwolves are right there, 16 and 18. Pelicans are 15 and 20. I wonder if that speeds up a possible Anthony Davis trade. That's what I'm hoping. Um, oh, Donovan Mitchell struggling too, says Rick Barker. How bad's a LeBron injury, he asks. Well, the MRI, MRI is clear. Thank God. LeBron James is, is going to avoid some lengthy time off. But I think he's going to miss some games. Uh, Josh Okogi, up and coming autograph, one in thirty-eight out of one ninety-nine. It's another Timberwolf for Jerry Bennington. But LeBron should be fine. I think he's going to avoid any. He's just going to. I think they're going to give him as much time as he needs until he's ready to go. But I think he will be missing some games. Um, conference finals ticket to thirty to one thirty five. Lamarcus Aldridge. And there you go. Yeah, we have the Jacob Evans and the Josh Kogi were two autographs. Three boxes to go. Yeah, there, there does seem to, EA is pointing out, there does seem to be a lot of stickers in this. It does look like that. Well, Prism Basketball, you won't find a lot of stickers, ladies and gentlemen, if that's, if you're a stickler about that. 
Go to jazbeescasebreaks.com. We've got a prison basketball mixer. Personal boxes as well. All right, three boxes to go. We're almost there, ladies and gentlemen. Almost done. We're making some good time on this break. We should be done in about 10 or 15 minutes. I don't think... Do I see any other orders coming in? What else do we want to do tonight? I only see one order coming in. No, three orders coming in. So we'll check those orders after this break. Maybe see what direction we're going to go in. EA needs a Mo Bamba out of here. We've got six autographs left. We haven't seen him yet. We hadn't, we didn't see him in case one, in pick your team one. So, but maybe we'll find him here in pick your team two. After a four out of ten, Jerry Lucas, old Nick, going to TC. TC with the New York Knickerbockers. There's J.R. Smith to 99. And your second autograph is nice. And the nice up-and-coming Jaron Jackson Jr. autograph, 117 out of 199, Grizz on the board. Corey K. Yusuf Nurkic to 199, Trailblazers. Two boxes to go. Four autographs to go, ladies and gentlemen. Good luck to all. Eight minutes left. Lakers taking a 101-89 lead. So, so far, so good. They seem like they're cruising. Coming out of the half, about seven minutes left in the, th in the third quarter. Trailers is up by one, 58-57 on the Warriors in Oakland. Just out of the half in Utah, Sixers up 61 no, Jimmy Butler just hitting a first of two free throws. 62 to 55. 850 left in the third quarter. And about 10 minutes or so left in this in this one, ladies and gentlemen. And a printing plate. Wow, an on-plate autograph for the Mavs. Costas ante the compo. That is for Josh Reich and the Dallas Mavs. The Giannis' brother. And the on plate, on plate autographs. Very sharp. Love them. Josh, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. Nice 
Nice case, ladies and gentlemen. Nice case. Finals ticket to 99, DeMar DeRozan. Playoff ticket to 199, Andrew Wiggins. Conference finals ticket to 135, CJ McCollum. Was there only one autograph in here? I mean, it was a Jaron Jackson and then the lost count. Last box. Good luck, everyone. Not sure what we're going to do after this, but I see four orders coming in now. Matt Bodner is saying, hey, how about down to three in Elite Extra Edition Baseball? Let's fill that one up. Elite down to two now. That's our last break. We don't have any more Elite after that. So if you want to go baseball prospect hunting, check out 2018 Panini Elite Extra Edition Baseball. Five box, random team break number four. One spot gets you two teams, two spots left. Jaspiescasebreaks.com if you're watching live. If you're watching this replay on YouTube, it's gone. Sorry. But there's plenty of baseball. So check it out. Tons of autographs in that Elite Extra Edition, ladies and gentlemen. Remember, be sure to read the item description. Some note about the international and collegiate players if you're not if you haven't done this break before. All prospects in that Elite Extra Edition. Alright. Last box, last two autographs. Good luck, ladies and gentlemen. And we've got for the Sixers, Landry Shamet or Shamet. Rookie ticket on card autograph for the Sixers. Randy Starr with the Sixers. One autograph to go. Maybe maybe some low numbered parallels too. Let's see. Good luck, everybody. I'm running out of space here too. Out of 135, Hassan Whiteside for the Miami Heat. And legendary contenders for the Mavs. One, two, three out of 199. Rolando Blackman. That's a good looking autograph right there too. <laughs> He's like more like no bomba. He's got to be in the next case. Cracked ice. LeBron James. Cavs edition. Four out of 25. 19 assists? It's a lot. Playoff ticket for the Spurs. LaMarcus Aldridge to 199. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. A nice full case break of 18 19. Panini Contenders Basketball in the books. We've got more in the store and random team versions as well. So check that out over at jazbeescasebreaks.com and we'll break more hoops with you next time. Bye.